Hi everyone, Oni here. So today we have a very exciting video. We're actually going to go and do the Sky Rise Celebration. Um, it's a pretty fun event. It's there for the Ishgardian Restoration. To get here, you go to the foundation um, and then you can go do the quest, which I do have a whole video coming out about that. And I hope you guys will enjoy that as well. Um, if you already have it, just go to the Etherite and go to Firmament. Yeah, there's 12 events and they are roughly an hour and a half apart from each other. So each of these fates, there are five of them. There are a certain number that you have to accomplish point-wise to be able to get full credit. The first one that we're coming into will have six points that you need. The second one will have three points. The third will have four points. The fourth will also have four points. And the last one, the fifth will have six points. For this very first one, you have to do an emote that mirrors what the mascot is doing. So if you do get lost at any point during this, you can actually look at the map and it'll show you a face of the mascot and that's where you can go that particular state. At the end of this video, we are going to go over what I got from each present. I will show you guys a drop table of what you can expect to get. After each fate is over with, you will get a certain amount of XP and you will also get 100 Sky Builder scripts and two presents. The presents, like I said, there's a lot of things you can get for them. You can get tokens where you can buy dyes, you can buy um, coffers for clothes, you can buy materia, and then you also get Sky Builder scripts, which I will show you guys both rewards uh, in their full. And I will also show you guys what emotes and stuff that they have there that you can buy as well. So roughly after every round, you get this for a level, I think I was 96 or 97, maybe 95. I can't remember. I've been doing this today. This is two separate days that I'm recording, editing on. So <laughs> it's been a little bit. Roughly, I got 419,000 XP. Uh, here, I didn't get any XP because I'm on a level 100 crafter. You'll see later that I actually noticed, oh shit, uh, I should probably change to... <laughs> A crafter where I can get XP on. This next event is called Made of Softer Stuff. We go with the Moogle mascot and he wants us to make Moogles, giant Moogles. We take them over to these wagons. You only need three of these.
this will be sheer yak with the chocobo and what that entails is we'll aim this cannon at a yak and basically blow off its fluff and you have to go pick up each of the fluffs that one you need to do it four times The next event is called Toy Hunter. In this event, you will look for the toy and return it to the piggy. Now, if you don't find the toy on your first go, it will turn you into a piggy and it only lasts for a few seconds and then you can go to the next present. Um, this one you actually need to do four as well to complete it and get full credit.
This is the fifth and final event and you need six of these to be able to complete it for full credit and essentially what we're doing we're taking these presents it's called presence of mind and taking them to the correct person so there's artisans children and merchants This is the last present and this will be our sixth point, what we need to be able to complete this. Now we're gonna go ahead and go over here and we're going to wait a little bit until the entire event is over. That way we can open all of our presents at once. Now there is each event has a specific timer. Once the timer is done, there's an extra timer that will go off of for another minute so you have another minute if you haven't gotten everything in you still have time so that is really nice about that There are some housing items too that you can pick up from here. Um, there are portraits of Emmerich. I think there's even one of Astinian here. There's a bunch of cute little minions you can get. Uh, there's, there's so many different things you can buy from here. And that's what I like about it is that it gives you something different to do change up the routine a little bit okay so let's open some presents i'm very grateful for the person who gave me that mount i really really appreciate it the first present we got an antelope stag horn the next present we get a fate token yay fate token yay <laughs> the third another fate token The fourth, another fate token. The fifth, nobody knew, but it's a fate token. Number six, 
another free token. Number seven. Holy shit, a free token. <laughs> Emphatic elucidation is what we got. Number nine. A fate token. And number ten. What will it be? I wonder. A fate token! This is all the things that you can get from doing this fate. So if you want to take a moment to read those, you can pause it at your leisure. And then this is what we got. 